Feel so bring great. Your friends too. Be like a little clubhouse for the gang you put together. Oh, Just that's bear nice. in mind, you're the only one gets to see the boss. Any friends you got, they can wait and sweet. Enjoy the dates, partner. They're plenty fancy. Alright. Well, I'll go back to the casino then, Victor. Thank you very much. I suppose. Some reason I don't feel so achieved after what I just saw happen to the Curatrons in there. Boone, are you out here? Don't tell me Boone actually went to the frickin' presidential suite and I have to go get him. Boone! Oh, hey, Boone. Follow me. I've got your back. Excuse me, but what? are you the courier who caused all of that trouble in the tops? Yes. Oh, great. The followers of the apocalypse, well, some of us anyway, have been interested in Mr. House's technology. How he stays alive. Yeah, of course, me no too. one else is allowed inside the Lucky 38, so no one knows what's going on. Well, except for you. Uh, and this is where I come in. Right. We just want to find out what sort of technology Mr. House has used to stay alive for all these years. It could be of great benefit to the people we try to help, many of whom suffer from hard to diagnose illnesses. Oh, that sucks. Doctor! <laughs> Fuck, I forgot my name. <laughs> Doctor King Chaos diagnoses a terminally low discussion of caps in this conversation. Ah, I see. I suppose I can give you some medical supplies for your efforts. I assure you they will be worth plenty of caps. Alright, I'll do it. Great. I'll have the medical supplies for you by the time you come back. Here, take this packet sniffer. It'll allow us to intercept data on Mr. House's network. You might have to manually remove the encryption from his data network, but hopefully you won't have too much trouble. Good luck. Alright. What? Wow. That's crazy. Yes, it is. Alright. So, we're on forward. Straight ahead. But, before that, you may remember I had a quest with the king. What my plan is, is to go and help the king first with Rex. Actually, not. Actually, yeah, I'll go help Rex. After that, then I'll deal with Mr. House and his Kaiser business. I don't have time for that. Please, the, the safety of a. Poor innocent animal is far more important to me than your silly. What do you call it? I gotta say though, I am starting to dig Boone style. I mean, it would be nice if I had some armor for him, but. What are you gonna do? Anyways, let's go in. Oh, shit! I didn't mean to go in there! I'm sorry, I'm not thinking clearly. <sighs> oh, sorry about that. <clears throat> I don't know how much longer I'll be able to do this, though. I've been doing this for a good bit. It probably won't be that much for you, because I had to redo the whole syndic with, um, fucking NCR. But for me, I've been doing this for a long, long time, to be honest. Well, not long, long time, but a good t hey. bit of time. 
Alright, so let's see. Where do I have to go to talk to again? Um. Data. Uh. Nothing but a hound dog. Hey, over here. Oh, there she is. Hey, Julie. Emily says you're working with her on bugging the Lucky 38. That information would be invaluable to our research if you can get it done. Uh. The king said you could tell me about his robotic dog. Rex? It breaks my heart every time I see him. He's such a good dog. Oh. The king brought him here for a treatment then. Yes, a few months ago. We had to tell him there was nothing we could do. So, you can't heal him? No. Rex's condition is way beyond anything we can handle. He requires brain surgery and some sophisticated cybernetics work, too. So there's no chance he'll ever get better? I didn't say that. What? While no one here has that kind of expertise, I do know of one man who might fit the bill. Of course. There's an old there's scientist one guy. named Dr. Henry who reportedly specializes in this sort of procedure. He'd probably be your best bet. Last I heard, he was living up in Jacobstown, far to the northwest. Jacobstown, huh? Thank you. You've been very helpful. No problem. Goodbye. What is this music? It's creepy. I kind of wish I heard this music in like a horror movie or something. Kind of sounds like something that I would hear in an animal. That was the name of the movie, right? The one with the monster that hunted people in the in the woods. Which at the same time, I still don't get why they call it animal if it's about a monster. Granted, it could be an animal, or it is an animal, but with a name like animal, I'd expect it to be something like a Jaws ripoff or like Grizzly. Anyone ever see Grizzly? Greatest bad movie ever. Alright? We need to go hunt this bear. Quick, get in the chopper so we can shoot it with a shotgun. Not to worry. I have an extra fucking grenade launcher here just for situations like this, sir. Uh, well, that's convenient. Let's go. And what do they do? They blow the fucking bear up with a grenade launcher. Big surprise. Which may be the greatest explosion scene. Because you can see, like, in the background, it's a different scenery they, like, use special effects on. Hey, King. Things have been a lot better since you helped with those soldier boys. Thanks again. So, what can I do for you? Julie Fargus says a man in Jacobstown can treat Rex. She said, what? Why didn't she just say so when I was there? Actually, come to think of it, I was pretty angry when I went down there. <laughs> I vaguely recall something about upending a few tables, maybe knocking out one of her doctors. Jesus. Anyway, that's incredible news. Only thing is, there's too much going on around here for me to make a trip like that. And I need all of my guys just to keep things settled here. You seem to be awfully interested in my boy Rex here. And you've done some good work for me already. I'll tell you what. You promised to get Rexy here to that doctor, and I'll lend him to you. What do you say? Absolutely. I'll see he gets better. I can't thank you enough. Now, there's a few things you should know about old Rex here if you're going to be traveling together. First, he hates rats. Can't stand the things. Giant rats, mole rats, doesn't matter. He catches a whiff of one, and he's off like a shot after him. <laughs> he's normally pretty obedient, but you might have to chase him some if he goes after one of the little varmints. Second, he doesn't like hats or the people wearing them. Don't ask. I have no idea why. Maybe because it rhymes with rats. That should be uh. it, though. Other than the occasional bad spot when his brain starts hurting him, that is. But I'm hoping you'll see to that. I wish you both luck. Take care of my Rex now, you hear? Let's talk Rex, with Rex. This is your new master. Protect him as you would me. Rex has given you the search and mark perk. Oops, follow, talk to. Alright, you got a thing about people with hats. Uh, we're on the same side, settle down. 
All right then. That does that, so. I'm sorry, Rex, but I'm gonna have to be having a hat for a good bit here, so. Yeah. Kinda gotta get used to that. Anyways, let's get moving! On to Jacobstown to cure the poor sick puppy Rex and become yokai leader or something. I'm sure I've been watching a lot of newer lately. Rise of the Demon Clan. <coughs> or Rise of the Yokai Clan. <coughs> Which, by the way, anyone who's seen that, I am a little saddened by that series. I felt like there's a lot of stuff that kind of went unanswered. Well, not a lot, but some stuff that kind of went unanswered. But it's just me being a big whiny. I swear to God, any time I watch an anime, I always have like this feeling after I'm after I've watched the series, like. There's something missing. Like, <laughs> I watched it with, uh, I don't even know. Like, if you know the names, I watched it with, uh, Heaven's Lost Property. And, um, there's another one. Oh, wait. School Rumble was one. Yes, I've watched School Rumble, and that one kind of disappointed me with the ending. And we've also discovered the north side, uh, free side north gate. But why don't I go to uh, items really quick and just, uh... Wait, where's my health at? Oh, my health is pretty good, okay. Um, oh, I can repair something. Oh, wait, we can repair Maria. Eh, why not? Sweet. Maria has a lot of ammo, too. It's also got, uses 9mm ammo. But yeah, I just like whenever I finish watching an anime, or anything like that actually, any series, I mean, usually it's specifically anime, because it's always like they end really abruptly, and it's like, why? <laughs> why? Like, I think with Death, though, everyone can agree, that was one of the, that was a pretty terrible ending. Like, in the end, Light just dies anyways, because after all that, he just dies. And then nothing gets achieved. Like, what? <laughs> We've stuck through how many episodes of this, and you're just gonna, like, pull the... You're just gonna, like, pull the wool over our eyes and just say, nope. That, that doesn't matter. Also, that thing is floating. It's just stuff like that, though, people, that I've always just, I, I just hate it. Like, afterwards, I finish watching it, and I just feel like crap, because it's like, aww. Ow. Get him, Rex! Oh! Rex means some business. Anti-venom. Cool. But yeah, I did. I did watch. Uh, I did finish. Um, what's it called? Yokai. Uh, no, it was the Yokai Clan. Not bad ending, but uh, it's just like one thing I would have changed. But that's just me being me. Ugh. I really need to do reviews. <laughs> I feel like doing reviews, honestly, a lot of times, but I also feel kind of lazy. It's like, oh, that sounds like it's a lot of effort. So, that's the main reason I don't do reviews. Just, it sounds like a lot more effort than this. This is just like, okay, whatever. I just gotta play some video games and commentate over it and edit it and call it a day. But with reviews, it's a whole not I can't even jump. There we go. Reviews is a whole other story altogether. 
guys, and I, uh, yeah, just, if I have what I envision, it's a lot of more effort than, it's, than this. Anyways, <clears throat> but yeah, so, uh, I think I'm getting a little out of it compared to when I started off, because now Benny's dead, and I'm just off doing stuff. The reason I'm over here, by the way, is, uh, something pretty important. If you look over there, you'll see something very strange looking. And if we look off in the distance, there's some enemies. Fucking aliens. Destroy all humans all over again. Oh god, they are pissed off. Get him! Rex is unconscious, that's not good. Oh god, I'm almost dead. Uh, give me some step backs! There we go. So I gotta deal with three of these fuckers. I kinda need the ammo. Or the health. They've all got laser pistols! That won't even do anything! God, give me a better gun! Uh, single shotgun? What do we have, shotgun wise? I think I'm gonna use a shotgun. Um, caravan Saudi. Leave me alone, you fuckers! I said, leave me alone! Die! Gotcha! Boone's not unconscious, is he? Get him, Boone! Get! Die! Die! Kill it, Boone! Kill it! Fuck! I DIE AT THE LAST SECOND, ARE YOU KIDDING ME? <sighs> uh. Well, that sucks. Alright, and we're back. So the shape, the, the shape, the ship is right there, and we're ready to go. Oh boy. Ah! 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 Kill it! Alien! Okay, he's right back on his feet again. That's not good. Ouch! Boone! Kill it! I'm not ready for fighting this thing and it's focused on me! Take hot shots out or something! Boone, you're a sniper! Hit the fucking thing! Microfusion cell. Alien blaster. And alien power cells. And some energy cells, laser rifle, blah blah blah. Uh, I think this guy has something else too, doesn't he? He's got tri beam laser rifle, two of them, and a microfusion cell. And I'm able to repair that stuff now, so. Yeah! Maria, repair with the 9mm. I didn't do that apparently last time. And I got something else I can repair. Yes. Yes, I think I'm good to go. Alright, let's go then.